Hello and welcome to We Are Finn. And with me now from Starling Jet, I have Saeed Mossini. Welcome to We Are Finn. Hello. Good to have you here. Uh, I'm, I'm very pleased to be seeing this 20, 20th scale model of um, the Starling Jet, something that, of course, you previewed with We Are Finn at Singapore Airport with Alan. Um, tell me where we are now with this, the update on this. Yeah. Uh, we have tested the 10% scale prototype. Uh, that test is completed and uh, the, the final model is in the stand at the moment. This is the 20% scale prototype uh, where we have done the hover test and we're going to do during the next few weeks the transition and, and cruise test on it. Uh, effectively, this is one fifth of the size of the real business jet that we are building in the near future. And as you say, a business jet, does this mean that the applications for the Starling jet are purely for, for the rich amongst us? It, it, it is for, uh, as you said, rich people, but it could be for everybody else because one of the applications of this aircraft is for air ambulance where it takes the casualties to hospitals three times faster than helicopters. And so the feedback you've had uh, displaying this and certainly the reactions people have had when you uh, first took this off, what have they been? Well, we have been an overwhelming number of people who are coming to us, to our stand, asking about when the product is coming to market. In the show, we had uh, uh, Supreme Jets as one, uh, one of the business jet operators. Uh, they have signed a, a letter of intent with us to, to purchase 16 of the aircraft adding the numbers to total 119 aircraft on, on an order book. That potentially means uh, $1 billion of sales. And uh, give me some details on the, on the jet then. How many passengers can we get on board? It can take uh, four to nine passengers, depending on the range requirement. And we would be certified with one pilot. And uh, the feedback then from the people that have been looking at it while we're here at Farnborough, what have they been on your stand? It's been significant because people were saying that we were expecting this and they were calling us Tesla of skies and uh, because they have seen this happening in other industries so they see that okay electric planes but at the same time vertical takeoff and landing this is what people are expecting both from industry and, uh, and market. Now, as we were stood at the stand uh, preparing for our interview today, I did overhear someone say, this is amazing, it, just, it looks like science fiction. But in fact, how does it feel to be part of what is now science fact? Yeah, it's great. But it's not just for, for myself, it's also for our team. Everybody, all of the universities, Cranfield University, Warwick University, Swansea University, University of West England, and all of the other industrial partners who are in, in this uh, project, they are very excited about it. Saeed, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you. And uh, of course, we'll keep you up to date with all the developments on the uh, Starling jet as uh, that takes place. You'll find out everything, of course, to do with the future of aviation every single day at wearefin.com.